So you're curious about being an x-ray tech and you're wondering, you know, how much money would I expect to make um, in this career? And you may be thinking, well, that's a pretty easy question to answer. But the reality is, no, you actually kind of have to look at the fine print. Um, so I want to look at the fine print with you, show you some of the research that I've done recently um, related to salary. And I think it's helpful um, to know that one of the top viewed videos on YouTube right now related to this is actually produced by nurses. So I know I'm throwing a whole lot of information at you really quickly. But I want to point out that, uh, you know, registered nurses, um, according to U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics, they're estimating a 77K annually um, versus over here. They've got radio radiologic technologists and technicians and the annual salary, the mean annual wage is considerably less than that. But I want to point out one uh, key term which you may notice here if you're reading the fine print again, technicians, right? Um, now you may hear radiologic technologists like myself kind of bristle at that term um, because basically this would be like saying, um, let's look at both registered nurses and also limited practice nurse nurses. Um, and average their salaries together. Also, I mean, this is this document's dated. This is the most recent data that they've got from 2019, but they're still referred to as using CAT scanners. Like we haven't said that since the 1980s. So clearly um, the government, no surprise, needs to update um, some of their metrics and some of their measurements. When I actually did what they've done here in average technologists and technicians together, when I averaged registered nurses with limited practice nurses, I get basically a wage that's essentially the same for nurses. So if, if money uh, was the determiner for you um, in looking at nursing versus a radiolog technologist, I would just say uh, consider one thing. Um, technologists have a wide variety of paths that we can go down. In fact, um, I was making close to six figures when I was working as a radiation therapist. So um, looking at these numbers, it's helpful to know kind of overall looking at the ASRT numbers. I think this is the most accurate number that's out there. It's from 2019. About 70K is the mean. That's looking at technologists from all the different states across the entire United States of America, just technologists. Um, they have separate uh, numbers that they report um, for different modalities. So like I can cross train into, com into computed tomography. I have licensure in that, radiation therapy, etc. So that's one of the beauties of the field is that you have a huge diversity of different professions that you can explore once you are a uh, certified x-ray tech. So that final thing is really, really critical. Let's look at some uh, job satisfaction stuff because it, it doesn't matter if you're making a whole lot of money if like you hate your work and you hate life, right? <laughs> I mean, that'd be a problem. Um, I could not find super uh, current data on this, but I know firsthand from working with nurses that it's, it's a pretty high burnout career. Um, and so if we look at how many were actually satisfied or very satisfied with their careers, about 33% of nurses are satisfied or very satisfied with their career. That's a problem, right? Versus roughly half of x-ray technologists would say that they're very satisfied or satisfied. Um, now there's all sorts of reasons why that might be the case. Um, I would love to see more recent data than what I was able to find with just a simple Google search. Um, but yeah, I, I think that's significant as well. We make roughly the same amount of money with options to progress into a wide variety of fields and we have, according to this, higher job satisfaction. So you may be curious now, well, what does it look like to be an x-ray tech? Highly recommend this book. It just recently came out from Pat Sedegas. It's a medical thriller, so it's kind of fun, but it's looking at the life of an x-ray tech in a small hospital in Austin, Texas. Really interesting read. You can find it on Amazon. Thank you so much. Hopefully this is helpful. Please give me a shout out in the comments. Um, like, subscribe, and I'll be sending you more videos here shortly. Bye.